Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited today. I'm going to open up my kit from Pampered Chef. I've become a, a consultant for them and we're gonna go through it together. Um, I'm probably gonna introduce you to the products and from here on out, I will also be doing cooking uh, with some of the products. So very exciting and I'm really happy to show you what I've got. So um, let's get started. Larger, largest kit that they have to start out with. I figured why not, it's an investment. So um, it costs about 283 once all of a sudden and done. Um, so that's not really bad. But first off in one box, I have the quick cooker. Ta-da! Now it came in three different boxes, so we have some stuff to look over today. Okay, so at the beginning of the box, it shows it has a getting started with your quick cooker. Sorry, <laughs> quick cooker cooking guide. Um, and the safety and reference guide. So that's awesome. And it's got service and support information on the back. All right, so we're excited. I can't wait to make something with this. So this particular product, it's kind of like, um, I believe it's like an Instant Pot type thing. Um, it's got, let's see if you can't see, settings for white rice, brown rice, whole grains, slow cooking, steaming, searing, proofing, which would be for dough, um, chicken and poultry, beef, pork, fish, seafood, soup and stock. Which I'm, I love to make potato soup, so it's awesome. Dessert, stew, chili, and then beans. So, and then it has a keep warm as well, and then a pressure cook. So, yeah, it seems to be a lot like instant pot, but it might actually have more stuff. So, I can't wait to look through and see what we can make with this bad boy right here. So, that is super duper exciting. Hey, baby. We can pass on the, the my husband's rice for somebody else. Actually, he'll probably want to, but I'll be cooking too many other things with this. I'm just opening up another box real quick. Okay, so what comes in here? Ooh, cool. All right, so you know when you go to do parties. You need to have stuff for carrying everything. This looks to be like that. And there's two of them. So it's got the Pamper Chef logo. And, oh wow, that's quite large. Seriously huge. That is awesome. Okay, so that's how wide it is. If you can tell. It's got this wide part and then like a front pocket. And then this piece goes down on the bottom on this side. So you can keep all of your stuff ready to go from house to house. Awesome. Okay, so there's two of those. Okay. 
me go ahead and open up this so I can put stuff in it as I go. Oh, and this one, as you can tell, has these little dividers and Velcro right here that divides them into little sections. That's pretty cool. Oh, but I need to get that piece of paper first. Now, I've been wanting to do Pampered Chef for a long time, so this is pretty exciting for me. Very excited. I know I might have to wait till, you know, stay-at-home orders and stuff, and people can gather more than a couple people at a house. But that's okay. I mean, I can do online for right now. And do online orders and online parties. That's fine with me for right now. Okay, so now you guys are going through this with me. I have hardly any idea what's in these. It says Sam Santoku knife, five inch. Okay, I gotta keep this looking nice so I can show people the parties and stuff too. papers with them. Had to use a knife to open up a knife. Oh wow, okay. So this is what it looks like. So the oh, that is gorgeous. Stainless steel blade. Oh, it says German C R M O V steel. Okay. Do some more. Oh, that's some more than I Wow. And actually, in the it tells you how to chop. So that's pretty cool. Not only does it tell you what part of, of the knife, what each part is, but it also tells you how to use the knife and not hurt your fingers. So it's definitely better to keep this for more than just the cleaning instructions and stuff, so that's great. to recycle after this. I have a feeling. Okay, so awesome. So I have a thank you with a like a thank you paper and a list of everything that came in the box. Alright. So awesome. A quick cooker, a ceramic pot. And that would be the Santoku knife. Yeah, okay. So this, oh, this is the ceramic pot. This is just stuff that came in this box, I guess. I assume that this goes like that. Oh, nice. And it needs to be a little top. Now, before I start doing parties and, and and stuff. I will definitely read up more on this. So it's on top of there. Okay. Oh, that is 
it does say on here, only use Pampered Chef authorized accessories in this quick cooker. So, so it's definitely something where you don't want to screw it up by using the wrong products in it. wires cradle which I assume that this this in and out it's possibly for the steam manual food processor with manual food processor interesting Okay, so this is a salad chopper. The one in front of these. Pair of these rather. And these it's like scissors. But it's got two blades right here. And you would put your celery, your lettuce, um, carrots, you know, whatever and you would just it's like that. That's awesome, then it it's like a little clothes thing right here. And close it back down. It looks really, really easy to clean. Awesome. Amazing. I don't want to throw any of those away. Always read instructions and care information. So. Oh, adjustable measuring spoon set. Oh, that is pretty cool. Okay, so if you can see, there's this little black piece that attaches to the piece that moves, or that's part of the piece that moves. And so at every setting, it gets bigger. So like this is a half a teaspoon. I'm sorry, one and a half teaspoons. And that's two teaspoons. And then that's two and a half teaspoons and then one tablespoon. And it also shows milliliters as well, in case that's what your recipe calls for. That is pretty cool. And then this one is smaller teaspoons. So we have a third, quarter, a half, three quarters, and one teaspoon. And then this starts at one teaspoon as well. Okay, so awesome. So those are pretty cool, and they're also small. You know, they don't take up very much room versus, you know, like, you know, this, and then you have these. <laughs> so all these in that. That's pretty awesome. So let's talk about space saving. That's really cool. Just for measuring screen size. Okay, so we have Southwestern Seasoning Mix. Um, so on my website, pamperedchef.com slash PWS slash TN Designing Mom, um, it's where you can go to either buy things, you can look up recipes and tips and instructions on cooking as well. Um, so I'm really interested to try the seasoning. Smells like it would be amazing on some pork chops or chicken. Ooh, this smells really good. Okay, so seasoning. We have another seasoning, garlic and herb. If this is a rub, I'm sorry, a rub. A little bit different. And then we have, I believe this is the manual chopper. Oh, quick slice. Let's 
slice, slice it. Okay, so we have the actual slicer itself, the base, which is where you would catch. Yeah, okay, because it closes this part. Cool, okay. So then you would put your tomato or your, you know, boiled egg, and then you would just go bloop, like so. And that's about how thick the slices are, if you can see that. And then this, it's round, so it's like this. And then we have a mixing scraper, mixing spoon. I'm keeping these just in case so I know whether it can be like washed in the um, dishwasher and stuff. Dishwasher safe. So it does say dishwasher safe. So I'm just keeping those so I can do some reading up and some research because I'd like to give everybody correct information. Um, but this is just me opening the box. So I still got to sit down and and read all about everything. Um, so I really like how this is kind of concave. Um, it seems like it would help because you could get it pretty close to your mixing blades, like so, because it would fit and you could really get the whole mixture. That's awesome. I like that. Especially when stuff wants to stick to the side of the bowl. Okay, so we have the microplane adjustable coarse grater. That's pretty cool. Good thing trash, like, trash is coming tomorrow to pick up our stuff. Lots of cardboard to recycle. Okay. This is pretty cool. Now I must figure out how to move it. <clears throat> and then some mini oven mitts. Oh, they go in my kitchen. What do you know? So it's got a smaller piece. That's one of the things with my other ones that they don't have. Like to where you can, it has like a little curve there too. That's pretty cool. Better for gripping. Cool. <laughs> Sorry, I'll play with them later. Got measurements on the side. Okay. Just keep little notes. Just enjoy your batter bowl. So this should be microwave oven safe. The bowl and lid are microwave, dishwasher, and freezer safe. The bowl is heat safe up to 350 degrees. The lid is not oven safe. 
And if you freeze the bowl, do not take it directly from the freezer to the oven, stuff like that. And it's all listed on this. So even if you were, like I said, say you bought yours and it came with it, whatever, you know, language you need, just cut off the rest. So it looks pretty awesome. a manual food processor lid. So that'll be a lid that comes with something probably in another box. Okay, so it's right here. Um, just information about your fast track rewards. It's got some, ooh, the enrichables, something I really want to try. Um, you add these to your dishes, um, like kale and fiber, um, pea protein, 10 grams of protein per packet. So you add one packet to boost your meal. And it gives you all the nutrition packs on the back side. So that's cool. Um, party planner checklist. And this is, looks like mailing. Thanks, no. Envelopes. Flyers. And, okay, so these are mailers that you can mail out with information and you can put your information on the back as far as your name and then who it's to um, get your sales receipts more more well I guess you do that but for the party oh that's probably just dividers actually for, for in this box um, contact paper where they fill out their contact information and what they'd be interested in um season's best and real time wins look like little booklets with recipes product info cards cool so everything that probably those have in them it's probably has on this be for learning about what i just received Recipe cards. That's cool. Quick start party cards. Oh, thank you notes. This is sample of them. Okay. And then a shopping. You can get gear with the Pampered Chef logo and stuff. If you're, you know, a salesperson, a consultant. And if you'd like to become a consultant, if you'd be interested, just let me know. And we can talk about that. And the more I do, the more I'll learn and the more I can teach. So that's pretty cool. I can't wait to go through this a little bit more. And as my clock in mean, my office is getting much more organized right now, so that's cool. I mean, I, I really have to look at this one. I think it's Nikki. Oh, I love it. I'm a little short, but I think it, yeah. Cool. 
gathers by the drawstring. That's the way I used to tie them. And for quickness, that's the way I'll tie them now. All right, so I'm gonna set that aside. The other side of it is upside down. Mealtime win is their current um, article. That's pretty cool. So let me just talk about this for a second. So these are like, not too thick, not too thin though. Probably a lot of good information in here. Oh wow, this is very detailed. I mean, it's kind of like a catalog you would see for, for most stores, except, I mean, they put a lot of stuff into one little catalog. I mean, you can just see by the amount of pictures and it has the prices as well. Sit and look through this. Cool, a deluxe air fryer. Ooh, I'd like to try that. And on the back, it has information about um, if you were to host a party, um, like on your your rewards, your free products, values, and stuff. And chop. Ooh, I need this for ground beef. <laughs> Swear, cooking ground beef, try to chop it up, it does not work. So this would be like in the pan. Just... That's awesome. Everything has the logo on it too. Good process. So that's that. This is the mini measure all cup. So the liquid measurements like this way, and then the solids and dry stuff will be this side. Let me flip it over. Let's find out how this, oh, there we go. Just flip it, flip it. Okay, cool. Yeah, now I can tell. I was looking at this one. Garlic press. You know, I've never worked with fresh garlic before. I'm excited to now. No more 
garlic salt for me. Dishwasher safe. Three year guarantee for non commercial use. So it does have information about guarantee and how long it should last for. Okay, so this is interesting. There's a cleaning tool inside. whatever garlic's in here out and then when you're done it just snaps right back into the handle after you clean it after you wash it that is pretty cool very very cool fresh garlic here I come y'all I seriously can't wait to use some of this stuff I can't can't wait COVID-19 go away so then I can go to people's houses and make food for them. I'm okay with that. Food holder. What does that mean? Oh! <laughs> it's for the microphone. Okay. Adjustable course. Oh, well, I got it right here. I get it. And that does come out. See, I need to down and look at all this stuff. Okay, so this does move out somehow. Because it shows it out. And then this, however, works, which when I figure it out, I will show you. But you will, you basically hold it up against it. Yay! Homemade salads. Because I don't know about you guys, but every time I buy a salad mix in a bag, um, whether I put it in a Ziploc bag or uh, whether I, you know, wrap it tightly with some sort of film or whether I fold it up and seal it, it still turns brown. So I am interested in the idea of making salads as I go instead of going from a salad mix. So that's pretty cool. And we got so quite a bit to go, you guys. This is piling up here. All right. But like I said, this was the biggest set. Um, there's three different ones. The lowest one starts at $99 um, for the, your kit to start being a consultant. Um, it just depends on how much you want to put into it, you know. But I feel like if I was going to do it, I was going to go all the way. So... That's why I chose the bigger one. To each their own, it doesn't matter. Because you can still show people how to do some stuff and if they, they like other things that they see, you know, and then, or you can buy more things as you go along to show people to have at your parties. So this is the manual food processor that this lid is for. It's, it's for the base probably to put whatever you have up in the fridge. Talk about space saving. Yep. And it tells you exactly how to do it. Works well to quickly chop herbs, such as parsley, basil, mint, cilantro, sage, or oregano. Here he goes fresh herbs too, not just fresh garlic. We're going all the way. We are going all the way. We're gonna make a lot of meatloaf, y'all. That's pretty cool. And of course you gotta take everything off because you need your covering the blades. So. Very sharp blades, yep. White clean with damp cloth only for the top. So <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. That's cool. So Okay, I don't want to mess it up with the cardboard on there. We'll leave it like that right now. Okay. 
silicone prep bowls set aflame. So that means when I do my cooking for YouTube, I can have things already set up like, you know, those TV chefs do. I can have things already chopped in little bowls for just pour them in. So we have lids. Two. Oh, these are cool. It's like a, a silicone. Yeah. yeah, silicone bowls. What it's called? Bowl prep bowls. Best way to get them open. Talk about airtight. Okay, so there's. They each sit in each other, so that's pretty cool. Boop, boop. And there's measurements. Both in cups and milliliters. And not only that, but you can see it from the inside. So that's pretty cool. You don't have to sit here and go like this or put it on the table and look all the way down. As you can see it, it's looking from the inside. So that's pretty cool. And all the tops that go with it. Oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. All right, bear with me just a few more things. Coated utility knife. Wash your knife and it's covered immediately after use. Remember, they are not dishwasher safe. Gotcha. Tongs. Who doesn't love tongs? They're so versatile. You can go use them for all kinds of stuff. Well, serving, cooking, whatever. Okay, dishwasher safe. Large chef's tongs is what they go by if you were to order. Oh, it just says don't do that. It's probably because they're new. There we go. Once I use them a couple times, it'll just fall down. So you point them down. Point them up a lot. Yeah, I remember everything's brand new, so I mean, it's not going to be worn in a little bit. A little bit stiff here, maybe. And this is a citrus press. Okay, so this is a zesto. I was looking at the other one, and I just thought it handles. Cool. You guys, I love to make homemade lemonade. Um, and I'll probably do that actually on here. Um, I make a simple syrup and then add fresh squeezed lemons and that stuff will disappear before the end of the day, within the next couple hours. So if we ever do outside yard work, if we were ever just spending time outside, going over someone's house outside, barbecue, whatever, it's really great to make some homemade, you know, um, lemonade. Don't get me wrong. I love country time lemonade nostalgic uh, for nostalgic reasons but the true taste of lemon and I can add as much sweet as I want you know it doesn't have to be too sweet so I mean it's really the best way to do it you can make it as much as you want and this is a so that is awesome. and I have lemons in the fridge right now Running out of room. Stop down anybody. Quick. 
would you go say? Yeah. Oh, I'm really excited about it. Okay. This is the Dutch oven. Rock crock. <laughs> That's cool. Discover the cooking power you never knew you had before with your new Rock Crock Dutch Oven and these fantastic recipes. You'll save time and boost results when you combine a variety of cooking methods that make the most of your Rock Crock. You can use the stovetop, oven, broiler, microwave, and grill, or any combination you dream up. Your Rock Crock can take the heat your kitchen dishes out. So that's super cool. Oh, it's pressing my hands. Oh, my goodness. Me and my husband are just being on a diet, so I'm going to have to make sure I'm cooking healthy stuff. But you know, I'm going to have to try some unhealthy stuff. Stuff has to be washed, anyways. Here goes. Look at it. It's one whole piece. Oh, that's awesome. That looks really easy to clean, you guys. Looks like it's really non stick, too. I can use two. Oh my gosh. What do I use first? My rock crock or. Cooker. I don't know. Oh, look at a large flexible cutting mat. You guys, I want to get some cutting mat. Ooh, oh, that's neat. That is nifty. Okay, so let's let's get chopping. It tells you the uh, Santo knife. Yeah. Tomato, it's a serrated blade edge to hold the tomato in place. Uh, bread knife, all purpose utility knife, which I have. Uh, chef's knife, which is for chopping. And then smaller cutting tasks, delicate and detailed work, peeling fruit, removing vegetable skins, etc. So it's got a measurement as well on here. So let's say you need to chop it up to a certain size. Okay. The hands on portions. Thumb tip is one teaspoon. One whole thumb is one to two tablespoons. Oh, palm is three ounces. Oh, that's cool. Fist is one cup. Handful, one and a half ounces. Or half cup or one ounce. Of, you know, the things listed there. Uh, and then two handfuls is one ounce of chips or pretzels. So it's using your hands to count your portions. It's got centimeters and inches on it as well. That's pretty cool. And then, oh, this is cool. Okay. So julienne, fine julienne, large dice, medium dice, and small dice. So like my onions for the meatloaf would probably be like this, you know, and then stuff for salad would probably be large dice. That is nifty. That one didn't come, so I will, I will be removing this portion of this plastic, believe you me.
this is probably to help. <laughs> I will not throw this away just in case this is supposed to be something important. So this is a large bar pan. So what I mean by bars like blondies, um, uh, like the little pastries that you make that you cut into almost like brownie size rectangles or squares. So this is awesome. This is stoneware, so it will naturally season and develop a nonstick surface over time with use. Slight sticking may occur for the first several uses. For best results, bake high fat foods, for example, refrigerated biscuits, or lightly brush with cooking oil for the first several uses. Aerosol nonstick spray is not recommended. So that cooking spray is a no no. Okay. It will create a sticky residue, which is difficult to clean. Gotcha. And it is difficult to clean even off of a regular cookie sheet. Do not preheat stone. Okay. So yeah, guys, I mean, if you're ordering anything, please keep the instructions, please. Even if you kept them in a little tiny folder, like a little um, manila envelope or something. But this is the bar. So this stone, put some good weight to it. I can see how it would probably stick for the first couple of times. That's amazing. So yeah. So this marks the first video of a ton of videos that I want to do, sharing things with you guys, uh, recipes, uh, whether it's old family recipes or something I just, you know, saw online or, or read in a magazine. Um, one of the first recipes I want to do is um, Bananas Foster pancakes. Um, they sound really awesome. I might even do Bananas Foster French Toast instead of pancakes because I'm a bigger French Toast fan. Um, however, like I said, you know, this will, this stuff will show up many more times in the videos to come, uh, in the cooking videos. I'll, I'll always label them cooking videos so that you know, you know, whether you'd like to watch them or not. But, um, I cannot wait to share some of this stuff with you guys. And there are some things that I saw in that thing that I would like to buy just out of the catalog. So if I think that, you know, I don't have it here and I think you'd like to see it, I'll probably get that so that I can... Uh, demonstrate it for you. So yeah, I hope you'll um, subscribe to the channel and come back and see me while I cook for you. And then, like I said, you can go to pamperedchef.com slash pws slash tn designing mom. And that's my website. You can order off there. You can look at recipes, tips, and information. Um, you know, if you have any questions, just leave them down in the comment below. I'd be happy to answer anything. So I'll see you soon. Thanks. Bye guys.